this sock that jug fans is your one here today with more fan games so I had recorded this earlier but apparently changing save states interrupts the uh, game so I have to redo this but anyway so this game is definitely worth it go check it out the link down below and if it's not specifically there check out the link to everything else down below because Sage 2016 did really good so this is Sonic 1 Mini Edition. We get the we get a spin dash and a drop dash. Now what a drop dash is is you hold the button and you go in. It works a lot like kind of like a shield in a way because it protects you from enemies. I'm skipping the invincibility because it made my computer lag last time, so I'm hoping to avoid lag this time. I know that may not happen, but still. And still try. Hmm. We got some good time. Under 40. That's pretty good. I'll take it. So, uh, there are Chaos Emeralds, but you can only collect them, like, at, uh... I have to think, Marble Hill Zone 2 or 1? So there was a life there, I'm gonna kinda skip it cause there's this. And as you can see there is actually some stage design difference in this. I managed to clutch that. Okay, so yeah. Really cool stuff. So we're gonna go to the left here. We're gonna come over here. We don't really need the invincibility because if we come over here. There we go. So we still made good time, 45 seconds, not that <laughs> 45 seconds, 45 rings. I couldn't have done that if I wanted to. <laughs> but anyway. This is definitely worth your time. It's really fun. It gives it that appeal of, hey, if this is how Sonic Mania is going to play, I'm going to enjoy it a lot. I'm just going to say that. That jump dash is so useful. It's so awesome. Useful. Awesome, made it. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Also, Dr. Eggman is in the place of this thing, which is kind of cool. Five, six. Okay, thank you. Thank you. Seven, eight. I don't know why, but I was having some really weird trouble. Okay, 55 seconds, not bad. 59 rings, not bad. <clears throat> this game is really fun, it's definitely worth it. I can't say anymore. It's, it, it's beautiful. Marble Zona. Oh no, I missed it. I thought I had it. Ah, dig it. So you gotta be careful of the crevices. Awesome. Made that. So we try something risky that seems to have worked. Well done. So, try a few risks. You might actually learn something secret. Or learn something new. Whee! Awesome. That was a weird animation. I just saw Sonic's character model. Why couldn't I move properly? That's weird. Oh, but yeah, this is it. Uh, I believe this is... No, this is Zone 1. Okay, so you get it in Zone 1. This is where the emeralds are. At the end of the stage. Um, I don't know if you need rings or anything. I've always just had a ring. Just... 
as a precautionary measure. There we go. You might little cheat, so be careful with using the jump dash around there. Or the, uh... What is it called? What is the new spin dash thing called? Here it is. So all the, uh... All of these are uh, emerald stages are still the same. Nothing new here. Um, but it's really fun still because they added some extra like textures or something to make the rings a bit shinier. Either way, the game is more appealing. I will say that this game is way more appealing. So I'm not going to continue collecting the uh, Chaos Emeralds, I'll probably just collect that one and move on. And I'm not going to try to load my save state from the beginning of Act 2 because that stopped my recording last time. There we go. I'll be a bit patient. And go. I couldn't jump. So I'm gonna get that, but I'm not gonna collect it. Awesome. If you go ahead and move on then. Zone 2. Because I want to show you guys. Uh, it's pretty much the same thing, actually, now that I think about it. But, uh, the uh, fact that you have Sonic with his Mania form makes it feel different somehow. It just... It's as if, though, you're playing with a whole new Sonic. It's weird. But it's cool at the same time. There we go. So let's go! Oh yeah, uh, around here the spikes and stuff get a little glitchy. I gotta say, the hardest level on this is uh, Labyrinth Zone 3 because the spears become glitchy and they are really hard to see, so if you're trying to make it past that boss fight, use save states because you won't be able to see the spears half the time, trust me on that. <clears throat> Unless you guys get a version that's not glitchy, in which case, well done. But the shading and everything just looks so awesome. This guy did a really good job. There we go. I love that little shortcut. Awesome. Careful. You want to be patient. I just let that moderately really comfortable. There we go. Sure, we'll collect you. I'm gonna go ahead and get this. Bingo. And now we're wasting time. Come on. Come on, the boy. There we go. Oh, cool. So they do start appearing afterwards. It's good to know. I did not know that. Uh, but yeah. Really fun, I will say. So we'll go ahead and finish this off, and this will be the end of the video. I hope you all enjoyed this as much as I did, because it was super fun, actually. Getting to play this again, I will definitely be playing this again, obviously. Because they got the monitors and everything just looking so pristine. So here's click here. Sorry, concentrating. Here we go. Whew. 
so I don't need no shield. I'm good. I know my way around this place. <clears throat> so we're just gonna go ahead. But Sonic's character model looks so good, by the way. I don't know if I've mentioned that, but... <sighs> this game just feels like it's preparing you. Why did I miss? Why did I miss? How stupid can I be? Why did I miss? That's stupid. I know. I know I'm stupid sometimes. Ooh. Okay. There we go. I gotta be careful for a little bit. Yeah, because that happens. Okay, here we go. Get a shield. We're already doing great because we got this now. Oh, yeah. So we're going to wait because that's a death trap. Boom. And that's how you do it. So we're going to wait. There we go. Yeah, that's that. Okay, there we go. Not bad. Especially if you know how to play Sonic and stuff normally, you, sh you should be good. Just everything about this game looks so good. I don't know why. I think it's just the fact that Sonic looks good and it makes, like, the entire perspective of the game seem somehow... In a way, different. It's almost weird. Okay, I hit down. Thank you. So there's a life down there, but I don't need it because it's going to be the, like, the last video I'm doing for you guys. There you go. What the heck? Okay, so that happened. Like, for some reason I may have hit the jump dash, thinking that, I don't know, I would get my invincibility shield, because I've been playing a lot of Sonic 3 lately, because I got Sonic and Knuckles separately, and that was a game I used to play, ooh, a lot. That's actually one of my favorite games. Oh dang it. Oh well. I did good. I got one ring. One, two... Why? Why? Why did you keep me there? Why? Why did I hit him? I wasn't meant to hit him. No, I need a ring. I was not even supposed to hit him that time. That was... That was boo-boo. This is BS. Thank you. That was boo boo. Why did I get why did I get him there? I wasn't even supposed to. Maybe Sonic has a higher jump in this, I don't know. I feel like that's something I would have felt that I would be feeling. I don't know why that happened. That just happened. Oh well. So that's the end of that. I had a mess up. I don't know why, but it happened. I hope you all enjoyed the video. It was fun doing. I hope you will definitely go get this game because it is worth it and it's free. <laughs> so definitely go enjoy it. And I will see you all. Excuse me. Next time. Enjoy the video.